Time to get yourself some purpose. Yeah, chicky chicky yay. Man, the amount of volume, 100 eater volume yesterday. What was that? That was a lot of money. It was $13,000 worth of volume. Actually, it's not so much. So yeah, 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 yeah. Either way, can you guys hear me? Yeah, you guys can, right? Yeah, you guys can. Anyone here is going to get... Who is here going to still apply in Camova? Are you guys afraid? Are you guys afraid of, uh, of Corona? We're actually making quite some... We're taking quite some steps for Corona. Uh, we're even getting, you know, certain things, uh, supplements and stuff. But I'm keeping it a bit on the low. I don't want to make people panic here, but we are making sure everything is nicely taken care of. And um, yeah, so, so everything gets really nicely, nicely sorted out. That's what we're doing. Easy peas. That's what we're doing, man. Hell. That one le year lentil reserve not looking so pointless anymore. Yeah. Actually, this place is really good for Corona. I mean, like, if you want to quarantine yourself and do something productive with your life, then this is the best time to come over. You're literally more likely to get it where you are at home. You might say, like, but traveling, I'm going to get it. Now, nah, man, it's very unlikely. Nobody's traveling right now, man. You're actually more likely to get it from your friends and family now that come and visit you or whatever, unless you have zero visit. So applying and coming over is obviously pretty much a fucking no-brainer. I wonder if people realize that shit. Now... Could you get someone to add me for the beta access? Google will not send you an email. You will be able to access the link once we added you. So try out the link every once in a while after you applied for beta access. Just apply to my phone. Well, it takes a while and then it will work. You are getting added. It can take up to five minutes or something. Then you can try out the game. No, 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 we automated it. It's actually quite crazy what we're doing with the game, though. The way we, we have a workflow and how we optimize stuff, it's very impressive. It's really impressive. I'm actually blown away myself because, man, these are a lot of clueless people that are working on the game, a lot of people that have zero experience and learned everything from scratch. No, the instant loading and new menu is not updated, but it is in the last dev, but you don't have that. This guy doesn't know how to go. 
this guy doesn't know how to go to oh no he's there profeta i see him but yeah people get getting their cells their purpose is there actually anyone here that that's gonna come over we actually had a guy come over uh, apply bamomoto i think uh Yeah, Bamo Mojo. You guys remember the guy? He applied. You know, fascinating thing. He applied and he said, he's a guy with chronic fatigue syndrome, right? That has autoimmune disease. You guys remember him? That got banned at one point because he was, you know, saying like, yeah, it was not good for him to come over. He actually applied. He applied because of Corona. He was like, yeah, man. I'm really high at risk. I put my life in perspective. I'm applying. I better late than never. Yeah, there's still spots left. Well, spots left. People said they were like there is ten people that don't mind sharing their room. So yeah, the new people that come over won't share a room though. It's only people here that volunteer to share a room that would share a room. Yeah. Man, there is here a woman, right? I didn't even know that ever happened. A woman that lost her arms and got arms from someone else transplanted like half a year later and she can move them and everything it's like what the fuck i didn't know that was even possible can you make instant loading with unity using tiny project tiny actually that's a very interesting thing you say there mr peer but project tiny does not have the tools to have our game project tiny only supports very simple games and our game is way more complex than that but it's something that you know we also looked into but no we had to do something else. Man, that, that what we did right for our game to load instantly, I think games like Clash Royale and Supercell, they would pay millions for it. I literally, they, I literally think they would pay a million dollars for the R&D to find that out, how we did it. It's quite funny actually how that works. I think a million or two, I don't think so much more. I mean, if they put a lot of people on it, they will figure it out at one point. But I don't even know if it's Supercell made by uh, Unity. It's only for Unity interesting. Yeah. What if someone leaves and sells the ID? You mean Fedor or Cedric? Because it's the only ones that can do it. And Jan? Nah, they ain't gonna leave. And also, these guys are millionaires anyway. More than millionaires. Already. I mean, like, let me tell you something very interesting. People that come over, right, and really put their effort in doing good, they are driven by purpose. They are not driven by money. Like they're, they're driven by giving back to the world. The people that come over here, not all of them, but quite a few, they, are, they don't have a prize. And that's the thing. If, if what we do grows, right, we will get the most intelligent and competent people on the planet because they already have money and they want to give back. And if they see what we do works, and actually does a lot of good in the world, they will use their intelligence to contribute to that because it's a fucking no-brainer. If I would have found an organization like what we have, right, when I was younger, I would have joined this shit a long time ago and I'm extremely intelligent. I don't want to put my intelligence to make money. I never cared about it. I don't want to put my intelligence for fame. I don't care about that either. I want to do something that matters. And that's the thing. If you go do your nine to five job, 
moment you have all your money, what then? What's next? What's next? It's empty. Life is fucking empty. At least when people apply and come over here or find like-minded people and do something meaningful with their life, their life, you know, starts mattering something rather than just being empty, waking up for nothing, just to play video games, just to do whatever the fuck. Fuck that shit. People can do so much good in the fucking world and we are making that happen. That's the good thing. We're just making that happen. And as we will have success, man, oh man, I'm telling you, we will get so many competent people to join. Because it's a no-brainer. Yeah, there was a guy that was thinking of. Yeah, it's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> link, link this. Man. This is fucking funny shit. Yeah. It's very interesting. Yeah. It's seven o'clock, guys. I will tell you guys, try out the game, apply if you want to come over before it's too fucking late. Do it, do it, and get yourself that sweet ass fucking purpose. Because, man, everything is tanking, everything is going down the shitter. But, man, oh, man, our good old homie's purpose is always there going up and up. Keep it up. See you guys tomorrow. Peace out.